Hey guys, just Elle again, and today I'm coming at you with a bit of a different video. Now, if you read by the title down below, you see that it says clothing swap. On the weekend, me and my mum and all her friends had a clothing swap to raise money for one of my mum's friends to go to Afghanistan to fix children with clefted lips or clefted palettes. And what we decided to do was go through our wardrobes, chuck out a whole bunch of clothes, bring them all together and form this massive pile of clothing that we can all go through to see what we'd like to get. We all donated money and it was like a huge, huge success. So if you were there, thank you so much for coming. But now I'm going to show you everything that I got. Originally, everyone was just going to bring clothing. But then I guess as people were going through their wardrobes, they found different things. So I'm just going to show you everything that I got. Now, I'm not going to show you in the order that I got it, but I'm just going to show you. One of the things that I got was this handbag. I always see these handbags around and for some reason, I just really love them. Like I love all the... um you know, designs on it and the pictures. It kind of reminds me of like a Vogue magazine in some ways. So I got that. Then I got a few like random items Then I'll get into the clothing. I got this Goldwell Volume Power Whip Hair Mousse. I've been really into doing my hair differently as you guys can see. Um, and I've been wearing or trying to wear my hair out a little bit more. Um, but I do have a problem with volume because I do get my hair thinned. Um, so this should hopefully help that. I also got this Schwalschkopf hair um, styling curl flex mousse because I think I even wrote a status about this on Facebook. I've been getting really into curling my hair and having like my hair just pretty and curled. So this should hopefully help the curls hold because that was like one of the problems of mine is that the curls never really held because my hair is very, very like silky. I then got this more Casse Noir um, little set and that's a rollerball and then a soap. I saw this and I just I pinched it up straight away. It smells so amazing. I absolutely love it. And then the last things that I got um, out of the like randoms were these Eye Lure individual lashes in black and there's long, short and medium in there. And I've never actually tried individuals, so I'm really, really excited to try those. So yeah, now onto the clothing. Now I do have quite a lot of clothing, but I do not want you to think that I was greedy. Everyone got heaps and we've still got like a few boxes that need to go to um, a local charity shop. So a few items in here. I did just grab because I thought, why not? They're just going to go to the op shop anyways. I may as well get them because I kind of like them. So yeah. So the first item that I got was this shirt. This is an absolutely stunning shirt and this was originally from Maya and it's in a size 16. It is too big for me, but it does have these tie ups on the back. If you can see that, I absolutely love this shirt. These are so flattering because it like singes in around your waist and then it fla not flares out, but kind of like goes over your belly. So I really love this shirt and I cannot wait to wear that. Now this one is one of the ones that I just thought I'd just grab because I like it um, and no one else had gotten it. And it's just this dress by TS in a size small. It's very layery, very bright. I thought it would be fun to babysit with. It's not too long. It's like it comes above the knee for me and I just absolutely love the colours. A lot of people were saying it was very 70s but I really liked it so I grabbed that one. I then grabbed this kind of corset style shirt. This was originally from Fashion Fair and it's in a size 14. I have seen these with jeans and boots um, and a blazer and I just think it looks so pretty. So I'm going to try that little look and I really like this because it's not like an in your face, hey I'm a corset, it's just kind of like a shirt with um, ribbing. So I really liked that. This shirt is once again one of the ones that I thought I may as well just grab because no one else had gotten it and the only reason I got this was because of the fabric. And this is what it looks like, it's just this like velvet patent like fabric I guess. I saw a skater style dress the other day made out of this fabric and I just absolutely loved it. So I grabbed this shirt in hope that I could do something with it um, but I'm still unsure of what I'm going to do with it so I grabbed that one. I then grabbed this dress and this is Lily Whitey um, in a size 10 and this is what it looks like. It's an absolutely stunning dress that singes in around the waist and it's got little cap sleeves which I like and it's not too long but it's a pretty good length. It comes above my knee. Um, you guys may be seeing these dresses and thinking that they're very long but I am six foot three or 188 centimeters tall so that's really quite tall. Um, 
But I absolutely love this one and I thought it would be great for work. So I grabbed that one. This next item I'm absolutely in love with and obsessed all at the same time and you guys are going to see it and think that I'm an absolute freak. But I love these and it's just these shorts. They are so like 70s and I just absolutely love them. I think they are so gorgeous. I cannot wait to wear these like I just I think they're the coolest things ever. They're by Gingerbell and they've been made in Australia. So I'm supporting the Aussies, but I just absolutely love them. Like seriously, and they fit like a glove. Like I put these on and they were like, they were made for me. So um, yeah, when I saw those, I snatched them up instantly. I absolutely love those. I then grabbed this dress and this is su um, Spicy Sugar. Um, and it's in a size 14. This is like an interview dress. It's too big for me. It goes above the knee, but I have an interview coming up and uh, for a job obviously and when I saw this I thought this is just so perfect because it's not like over the top um, very you know professional it's just kind of classy in some ways and I don't really have anything like this like business style so I thought this would be perfect for my job I then have this one and this is um, fashion fair in a size large and it just looks like this it is so pretty. I love this kind of chest piece. It's very like Egyptian to me. And then it just goes out into this normal little uh, flowing dress that comes a lot above the knee for me. So I might pair it with leggings and boots in the winter. Um, I just absolutely love it. I think it's stunning and it's very figure flattering. So I grabbed that one. This one I'm also in love with. This is by Valley Girl and it doesn't have a size on it, but this is what it looks like. I think this is so fun. It also comes with this um, tie as well, but I just think this is so fun. It goes a lot above the knee for me as well. And I just think it is so pretty. I saw it and I just snatched it up. I think it's really cute and very flirty. So um, I, I love that one. I this set. And this is a country road in a size extra large set. Here is the hoodie. As you can see, there is the hood on the back. Um, I just got this because I love lounging around in these, especially in the winter and knowing we are coming up to winter soon perfect and here are the bottoms and they're really long as well so they um, are the same length as my legs which is very unusual especially for me I then have this singlet from Jockey and it just looks like this animal print is so in and I absolutely love this I cannot wait to style this with like a pair of high-waisted pants and you know a cardi or a blazer or a jacket or something like that just to have like a pop of pattern I guess. I really like it and it's really really soft so I can't wait to wear that. I then got these jeans and these are fashion fair in a size 14 and they're just these cut off jeans and for me they're cut off just above the knee and so that's perfect for me because I am going into disability so they like you to have things going to your knees but a lot of the things that I found that went to my knees were very baggy and big and I didn't really like them because they didn't really flatter me at all. Um, but knowing that these are skin tight, they look really nice on. So I'm really excited to use those ones. These ones don't have a brand name, but they just look like this. They're just mini jean shorts and I wear these around the house or going on walks or things like that. So I grabbed another pair of those. This shirt was um, another one of those, I'll just grab it because I like it and no one else has. This is by K Derry in a size medium and I just thought it was so pretty. It's very not my style though, that's why I wasn't originally going to get it. But when no one else did, I just thought I may as well. It's got sequins on the flowers on the front and I just thought it was really pretty so I've still got to figure out a way to pair this. I thought maybe with like denim jeans and boots for the winter, that would probably be really nice. I then got these pants, and these kind of remind me of pregnancy pants. Um, they're by Go Girl in a size medium. There's the band at the top, and that's what the pants look like. They go to my ankles, and they're just <laughs> like this huge wide leg kind of pants. They're extremely, extremely comfortable, um, but they kind of do remind me of pregnancy pants because of the band up the top. But I love them. I thought for lounging around in, they'd be perfect. And when you wear them, they kind of look like a skirt. So that's a bit different. I then got this shirt and this is by now in a size 14 and I love this shirt. It is so pretty. Every single color on here is like my favorite color. It's very big and flowy. I'm so excited to pair this with like a high waisted skirt, um, ballet flats and like a blazer or a jacket. I'm so excited to do that. 
because I think this is absolutely stunning. Some people may see this and be like, that's not their cup of tea and that's fine, but I absolutely love this shirt. So I'm really, really excited to wear that one. This is another one of the ones I'll grab it because no one else did. It's got stains all over it. I don't know if they'll pick up on camera. But I literally grabbed this for my hair dye shirt. Um, I always like use, you know, good shirts whenever I dye my hair. And I thought that I could just use this one because it's already got stains on it. And um, it fits me perfectly. So that's my new hair dye shirt. And this is by Peary New York in a size large. And it just looks like this. Combining two of my most favorite patterns like in the same shirt. And I think it works pretty well. It's knitted, um, so it'll be perfect for the winter to keep me a bit more warm. But also, when I say winter and wearing like short sleeve shirts and stuff, um, you've got to remember I'm in Australia in Queensland and now winter doesn't get cold and it does not snow. So I'm kind of usually fine with sleeveless um, as long as I just take a jacket with me. So this will be absolutely perfect for the winter with like a nice chunky bold necklace. I'm really excited to wear that one. I then got this shirt and this is from Supre in a size extra large and this is kind of like a joke because it says sweet as bro and I'm originally from New Zealand well I'm not from there but I have a New Zealand background if that makes sense and um, supposedly they say sweet as bro so grab that I got this one this is another one of the ones I'll just grab because no one else did it's by philosophy and it's in a size 12 it's just this skirt. I will have to um, shorten it because it's a very unusual length on me. But I just thought it was really pretty. I'm sure I'll be able to pair it with something and style it somehow. I don't know. We'll see. I grabbed this shirt and this is from Target and it's in a size 12. And I just absolutely love this shirt. It'll be perfect for work because um, it's like very like chic looking. And I work at a shop that's very kind of like higher class in some ways. Um, so I thought this would be absolutely perfect. I think it's really, really pretty. So got that one. I then got this shirt once again because no one else did. And I thought this would be a perfect little sport shirt because I do have other ones, but they're quite expensive. So I thought I may as well grab another one while I can. I then got this shirt and this is from Avocado in a size 12. And it just looks like that. It's got these two bits in the front to tie in the front, like over some high-waisted pants or something. I just thought it was so cute, and so I just grabbed that. This is by far one of my most favorite things that I got, and you guys are probably going to see it and be like, what the hell, it's not your style. And I understand that, but I absolutely love this shirt. Oh, I just love this shirt. I don't even know why. The colors, the, you know, the lace, the doily material, as I call it. Um, the lace on the bottom, it just all seems to work. It's very like farmer style in some ways. And I just thought it was really pretty and I had to grab it. It was by Caroline Morgan in a size medium. So I'm so excited to wear that. I'm seriously so excited to wear that. I then got this shirt and it's by Wish in a Australian 10 or a small. Just looks like that. And yes, it does jingle. Um, these little beads here perfectly match my high-waisted pants because my high-waisted pants have that like antique gold coloring on the buttons. So I thought that'd be perfect with my high-waisted pants. So that's why I grabbed that. I then have this jean vest. Has no brand on it, but I absolutely love this. It is going to go so well with my maxi dress. I absolutely love it. It's so cute. And I've never had a jean vest before, so that'll be fun to pair with things. I then grabbed this once again because no one else did. This is by Impulse in a size 10. And I thought the back piece was really nice, but I'll just probably just wear this around the house because it's a nice, comfy, flowy shirt. So I'm excited to use that one. I then got these pants from JJ's Denim in a size 14. Once again, um, for disability work. And they're just normal little jean pants. So yeah. I grabbed this shirt because no one else did and this is from Rockman's in a size medium and it's really pretty I thought for around the house it'll be really nice and cruisy so I grabbed that one and then the last two items are jackets I grabbed this jacket from Redberry in a size 12 and I just absolutely love this to me it's kind of like a pea coat in some ways I don't know why I think it's a pea coat but I just think it's a pea coat I think it's really cute it's got pockets in the front with two big um, red buttons so I'm really excited to pair that. I still don't know what I'm going to wear that with, but I'm sure I'll find something. And then the last item you guys are probably going to see and be like, what the hell? But it is just this blazer. 
just looks like this it's got buttons down the side that's actually not centered that's to the side um, it's got fake pockets it goes like just past my elbow and I absolutely love this you can't really see it very well but I just absolutely love it. It has tiny little shoulder pads and it's originally from that brand. I can't actually read that. But I am so excited to wear this. It is so figure flattering. I just absolutely love it. And no one else grabbed it. I don't know why. But um, yeah, I got that one. So that is all of the clothes that I ended up getting. I got so much, but don't worry, everyone else got so much as well because we all really did pull together, clean out our wardrobes and make a whole bunch of money for Kate so she can go over to Afghanistan to fix children with clefted lips and clefted palates because they have a higher rate of um, clefted lips and clefted palates over there. So thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like this video and I'll talk to you guys later. See ya. Thank you.